Peace family, welcome back to another video with Credit Healing LLC. Today we wanna to answer a question that was posed by one of our Credit Healing viewers. Her name is Christian, we have added you in our title, but we wanna be able to answer this question that was posed. And the question is, is there a solution for removing settled debt? Now, this is a very good question because if you have already decided to settle your debt, with the collection agency or creditor, now you're looking to go ahead and remove it from your credit report. Now, there's certain nuances that are involved with this particular question. Now, for those of you who are our clients, we always tell you that before you go to settle any debt, we highly recommend that you consult with us first because if you are looking to settle and pay off your debt, uh, whether you pay it off in full or pay um, a percentage of the total debt, what can possibly happen is that if you have paid the debt, say for instance, if the debt is five years old and you know it takes seven years for the item to get deleted or removed from your credit report naturally according to the statute of limitations, then what can happen is that by you paying off the debt, one thing that is uh, very detrimental that can happen is that the statute of limitations can actually restart. And what that means is that if you have, say for instance, two years left on your credit report for that particular account, and you're looking to go ahead and pay it off because you're trying to get a mortgage or a car loan, etc., then what can happen is that those years can start over from the time that you have made either the initial uh, payment on that particular account, or you have paid that debt off in full. So it'll restart to seven years. And many of these clutch agencies and creditors, they don't want for you to know this, but we're telling you this because I know this based on experience. So if you're looking to get this particular item deleted from your credit report, we highly would recommend that you don't try to dispute it online. You don't try to go to Credit Karma or Equifax.com and dispute it because most likely it's not gonna get deleted. There's a special way that you have to dispute it because by you paying the debt off in full or paying a portion of the balance that is an agreement that the debt belongs to you so now you have to take a different route to get it deleted because if you have paid the debt the creditor or collection agency they're not going to want to get it deleted from your credit report they're going to want it to remain there because now they don't feel as though that they're any type of mutual or contractual agreement that they have to uh, basically try to make with you because they've already collected the money right so what you want to do is you want to ha have a consultation with us you want to hire us to go ahead and dispute it and get it removed because although you have paid the debt off in full and it has a zero balance it's still negatively impacting your credit scores how because although it's a zero balance it's still considered a charge off account or collection uh, collected or collection account so if you have paid it off you don't want for that item to still remain on your credit report because now your scores aren't as high as they would be if the item was completely eradicated or removed from your credit report so to recap yes you can get it removed but there's a special way that you have to get it removed because if not it's going to still remain on your credit report and it's still going to hold your credit scores down all right, so we happen to answer that question for you, Christian. If any of you have any more questions, feel free to reach out to us at credithealing at gmail.com. And if you're ready to start healing and building your credit, go to www.credithealing.org. Peace.